Well, for many in West Michigan, visiting the butterflies at Meyer Gardens is a tradition. There's a lot of planning that goes into the annual event. We got an early look at the exhibit and all that goes into the largest temporary tropical butterfly exhibition in the country. There's 7,000 plus butterflies that will be flying in this space over the course of March and April with all sorts of family activities, things going on, you know, every weekend for, pretty much for families. Uh, open late on Tuesdays, you know, it's just a big ex exhibit for us. You know spring is right around the corner when butterflies are blooming at Frederick Meyer Gardens. And if you can't wait for the warmer temperatures to arrive, this is the place to be. You're in a 15,000 square foot tropical conservatory. No, you know, center support, so it feels like we're outside. You know, five stories tall, so when you walk into this space, you might as well be outside in the tropics. Steve LeWare is the VP of Horticulture at Frederick Meyer Gardens. He says they work three years out on permits, background, and governmental approval for this very special exhibit. We have to work with USDA and the uh, Animal Plant Health Institute, so um, all of those permits need to be uh, run through the United States Department of Agriculture. Steve says they have a plan for feeding and caring for all these butterflies, all 60 different species. These delicate, beautiful creatures Creatures have a short lifespan. On average, they only live for two weeks. That's why throughout the exhibit's two-month run, they'll continue to get more shipments of chrysalises. There are hundreds of butterflies that show up every week, close to a thousand butterflies per week that all need to be sorted. They all need to be, you know, carefully arranged within the observation station. And where are they coming from? Steve says most of the species come from tropical South America, like Costa Rica and Ecuador. But some come from Asia and Africa. All of them will live their short but elegant lives in West Michigan, where we get to enjoy their wonder and beauty. This time frame, March and April, is just such a great time because, uh, you know, we're coming off of the, we hope, coming off of the, the bulk of winter, you know, and it's just an opportunity for people to get into the tropics, enjoy these beautiful butterflies, and, uh, you know, just kind of absorb that warmth and that humidity that's in this space. And isn't that true? Doesn't it feel good oh, to walk in there? It's always the best, yeah. yeah.